So Tesla just had one of the best uh, week in a very, very long time. And this came with, the, with successfully hitting the production goal of 5,000 Model 3s per week, as well as them announcing some uh, interesting expansion plans uh, with one new factory in Hong Kong and uh, one to be announced in Europe. Now, Elon Musk shocked everyone yesterday with, with his uh, tweets to uh, announcing plans to, to take uh, Tesla private. And I believe this is very interesting to look at from two perspectives. The first uh, is from a PR perspective, uh, according to CNBC report, uh, this costed Tesla short sellers $1.3 billion. And uh, this was on top of uh, last week's uh, Tesla stock price uh, going up by as much as 16%. Now, from a business management perspective, and I genuinely believe here that Elon Musk's rationing behind this announcement was, uh, was this one. Uh, a private Tesla would have the luxury to both think and execute long term, so long as the funding would be, would be secured. And um, basically the main idea behind Tesla going private here would be uh, to no longer require them to report uh, at times uh, strictly confidential metrics um, to, to external uh, parties which basically uh, make it vulnerable to, to basically its main competitors as well as uh, Tesla short sellers. So to give an example here, uh, Tesla right now has to report um, all their, their numbers, their production numbers and their people numbers on a quarterly basis, which basically means that by the end of, of uh, this period of time, they have to shift resources from various departments uh, just in order to, to deliver on, on those promises to, to its public investors, which uh, is a very um, inefficient uh, way, of, way of thinking. It's a very top-down uh, organizational structure, which is, of course, not optimal. Now, what they could do here is to, um, to run some experiments, maybe, to, to see what works for them in terms of production, maybe setting goals of, uh, of one week or maybe a few months, or maybe no deadline at all here would, uh, uh, would be ideal here. So what, what Elon Musk is basically after here is to, is to run Tesla the way SpaceX, uh, his other company, is being run. And uh, as uh, per his own um, quote here, he wants to, to basically ration from, uh, from first principles. Now, if you're wondering how common is, uh, is what Tesla tries to do right now, uh, I think everyone knows of uh, Dell's example of uh, um, their famous fo founder getting their company private uh, just, I think, one year ago. However, I believe the environment and the, the scenario there was uh, a lot more different because he was looking um, to, to develop other products, custom tailored products by this move. And um, in fact, I believe another, a better example of what Elon Musk is trying to do here from another company uh, would be uh, Google's project Aristotle uh, a few years ago in which uh, basically hi uh, Google hired a, a team of uh, external researchers uh, to study i think 800 of their teams uh, to see what drives performance internally inside their organization uh, so um, basically the the move there inside google was uh, to find what works best and i believe that this is uh, this is what elon musk is also after right now also, uh, almost uh, immediately after announcing plans to take Tesla private, uh, Elon Musk sent one of, uh, one of his famous letters to, to employees and um, he was surprisingly direct in his uh, rationing around taking Tesla private as a, as a, as a mean to, to create operational efficiency inside the organization. Okay, so what's next for, uh, for Tesla is that uh, Elon Musk has now um, uh, to take these, uh, these plans to, to his decision makers uh, at Tesla and see if, uh, if he can successfully convince them. Now, um, also in terms of funding, because this is also a huge question mark uh, as to whom might be interested in, in finding, uh, funding all this, it's uh, not excluded that the, the Saudis would be interesting of expanding their, their already impressive portfolio 
of uh, non-oil uh, related ventures and also I'd be curious to know what you think uh, what do you think is is Elon Musk uh, making a smart move here or um, do you believe that uh, keeping uh, Tesla public uh, um, would be probably a better way right now that Tesla also gains some uh, some scale and some traction uh, with the investor community. I'd be curious to know what you think um, in the comments down below. Thank you for watching.